we're gonna do is find something good today. Don't have very long, we got about an hour and a half. As long as a bunch of fishermen don't come down because we don't want to mess up their fishing. But it's a beautiful day, 75 degrees. Hopefully some of the vegetation has died off, although it does not look like it at all. Maybe we will find something today. First thing I do want to tell you that we are getting a new magnet sent by my uh, sponsor, Root Magnetics. Um, it's going to be a brand new magnet for 2019 coming out. I believe they said it's between 1,300 and 1,500 pound pool, which is insane. Um, and I will definitely do a video for you all showing you that and when we use it. So, should have it by the end of the week. So next week, should get a video out on that. But we got the 500 pound today. Don't see anything off the bat, but let's get to it. Alright, my harness is acting very funny. Um, we're going to have to be very careful to not lose the camera. I might have to take it off in a minute, but let's throw it on in. Really do not want to lose my camera. Let me see if it comes off. Yeah, it just popped right off, so we got a problem. We're not going to use the harness today then. I don't want to lose the camera. I believe it's something in the bottom of the camera, that little screw thread. So, we might have to figure something else out for that. Which is hard to do this one-handed. But that's how it's going to have to be. I forgot to put my gloves on too. Nothing this time. Alright, get the gloves on and we'll try it again. Well, I could see something white coming on up here. Oh, oh almost lost it. Yeah. That is a rusted out big lighter. It's either filled with fluid or water. Since I turned you on last, I got an egg sinker here that was attached to a real nice hook. Circle hook. That's from last time. I popped out of the bag, but that's about it. A nice gentleman came down fishing, and I didn't want to disturb him. So I turned you all off for a moment. But, yeah, not a whole lot. I don't know, I've just been dragging the sides. I haven't really thrown it out yet. There's still just incredible amounts of vegetation still. It hasn't died yet. We haven't had too many cold snaps. The coldest has got like 34, like twice, so not enough yet to kill everything off. I'll drag it down here once. I really wish my harness was working. It makes it easier having my two hands. But we'll throw this thing on down here. Pull it on up. <clears throat> and see what we got. If anything. I really can't wait for that uh, what, 13 to 1500 pound pull magnet. That'll be incredible. Cannot wait for that. Alright, let's pull this bad boy up. Let's see what we got. If anything, probably nothing. Come on, a whole lot of seaweed. That's all I see. Yep, and that's all. You all see that fire off in the distance? Definitely a big old fire down there. Right by that uh, telephone pole. Whatever you call it. <clears throat> Something's a burning. That's probably about 10 miles off. I see something pink. This is really hard to do with one hand, but. Oh, is that a bra strap? That might be a bra strap. 
or not. No, maybe, I don't know. I got no idea what that thing is. It's got little buckles on it. Tell me what you think. It's a strap of some kind, it looks like. It wouldn't be for anything functional like a camera or something. Do not know, adjustable strap. Oh, this is weird. That's got to be a fake fish. Yeah, that's a fake fish. I thought it was a real fish for a minute that got hooked. But now it's one of them uh, fake... Fake fishes. Destroyed. Probably by gar, I'd guess. Garfish probably uh, chomped on it. They got big old sharp teeth. Garfish like... Messing up your stuff. But they sure are tasty. If you've never eaten garfish, I highly, highly recommend it. I know it's a trash fish, and a lot of people don't think it's appetizing, but I tell you what, garfish, it's like eating lobster, man. It's some good stuff. You should try it if you haven't. Well, I got a couple bottle caps and a nail. That's about it so far. Not a whole heck of a lot. Well, this has been pretty much a bust. So one more time out. Hopefully something comes up. Up and down in the mud. Just has not been productive at all, except for a very few things. It's just too much vegetation out here. Can't get even begin to get down to the mud without ripping everything up first, but I need like time to do that. I don't have time today. I might stay around a little bit longer, but this might just be the last one. Okay. We're on up. I don't think we got anything. Oh Nada. Alright, I'll tell you if this is the last one or not in a little bit. Now, I did feel a little tug. I don't know if it's seaweed. Like a little snap. I don't know. If it's anything, it's probably not. Just threw it right in this little corner area here. So, let's check it out. A bread tie and a circle hook. That wasn't what I felt, so who knows. Hang around for a couple more minutes. Alright, this is gonna have to be it. A little bass bait thing destroyed. A lighter. Egg sinker circle hook. Bra strap. Another hook and a bread tie. That's gonna have to be it. I'm sorry folks, was not very good of a hunt today, but we will be back, um, and I can't wait to use that big boy magnet, <laughs> 1300, so I'll see you all then, and I had fun today, we only had an hour, but we did find a couple interesting things, alright, I'll see you all in the next.